Hey everybody, Adam Tereska, Adam Tereska Videos. I'm in Centralia, Pennsylvania, and in the current spot I'm in right now is the original home of town founder Alexander Ray, and later the home of the American Legion for Centralia. Here we can see this depression. This is where the time capsule was at the time. It was supposed to be opened in 2016, but was taken out of here in 2014 and taken to Wilberton, Pennsylvania to be opened after vandals tried to destroy it. Over in up here, in this area here, about is where the building was. The cinder block in broken pieces in this location here is where The Liberty Bell for the town once stood. Somebody has actually tried to make an effort to fix it up as best as they can as a sign of respect, for which I'm grateful as a veteran myself. They did what they could with what they had to work with. They added some fresh American flags, they have some red, white, and blue flowers. You can see the poles where they I believe we were able to operate the bell. They ran the ropes through those poles and they were able to ring the bell. And over here, in what has to be an absolute work of art, this wall. This wall has been up since the 1800s when Alexander Ray originally owned the property. The craftsmanship is absolutely incredible. But this was the location of where the American Legion and Alexander Ray once resided. As we come up this way more, I'm taking you now to where the high school was. high school and athletic fields were here in this location. It would later become a furniture warehouse. Before it was eventually torn down due to the mine fire. Once upon a time, across the street from this school, there were homes and there was even a municipal style park just over there on that side, which I'll take you to shortly. But I wanted to show you the school grounds and the former athletic fields, which were in this location here. This is the approximate location where the football field was. Here you can see some of the stairway and the stonework. where the school property was. I'll watch my footing. Here you can see the, as I was mentioning, the masonry and stonework from where the school was.
It's amazing how the town has been completely been erased nearly with only a few homes left. Trying to find the steps. Let me find the steps. So we're back up on the property here. As soon as I find the steps, I will kick it back on and we'll have a look at them. Okay. Found a section of pipe here. I'm going to guess that this may have been a pathway, and this was a gate, to keep the school grounds closed off. As we're still going to find the stairs that led up to the athletic field from Main Street. But I thought this was an interesting little tidbit, finding this pipe here. I'm not sure if it was for a gate or not, but it would seem to be being this is the school grounds. And up by RJ. See the foundation remnants? I'm looking at it right now. We have remnants of a cinder block from a potential foundation. Definitely either from the v, the American Legion or from the school. We have a block from the foundation. Now we'll go back to trying to find those steps for you, and we'll get those documented as well. Be back in a moment.